Welcome, looters, to the really awesome unboxing of Gold Simulator 3 Coat in a Box Edition. I am the Loot Gamer. If you guys enjoy this video, give us a like, subscribe, and don't forget to ring the notification. Having a look at the packaging over here, fellas, we could see Goat Simulator 3 looking really awesome over here. This cost me 100 Australian dollars, and honestly, we are getting a whole plethora of loot. But having a look at the front packaging over here, really nice. You gotta love that, how nice that looks like. Very small and compact. Side profile over here, you can see some really awesome stuff. Animals may bite or kick. <laughs> Isn't that really awesome? You can see a bit of a plushie there in his really nice looking manger. The back over here, you guys can see all the really awesome details. Yeah, so let me kind of zoom in so you guys can see what we get. We have ourselves a reversible poster, a soundtrack, a goat house, really nice cool looking plushie, a steelbook case, the game and postcards as well, fellas. So this over here is, I would say, what every single collector would want. At the bottom over here, you can see brand new open world, dress up your goat, faux goat local and online co-op, looking really awesome too. Side profile over here, you can see the goat and it's a gorgeous looking um, house itself. And I'm really loving this packaging. So let's unbox this product, fellas, right now. All right, so right now we are going to ramble this. I'm not gonna waste no time and to be honest I really hate removing the seal of collector editions because as you guys know being a collector sometimes you want to just keep it sealed but of course we are an unboxing channel so we got to do what we got to do and over there that's all off and it's amazing glory there let me kind of um get rid of this so very gentle and over here you guys can see some really nice looking artwork here and oh man this is looking hot man you can see over here goats in the three go in the box edition you can even see the plushie there as you guys saw before even the back over here that kind of consistency when it comes to the really nice artwork top over here you guys can see goat in the box the bottom over here just plain and black so i kind of moved the camera down so you guys can see exactly what i see but let me kind of just open this up as you guys can see over here, this is exactly what we get. A really nice white box. Of course, the game all sealed sealed up. Let's kind of uh, undress this game and use our Rambo hands, if I can. It's kind of crazy that I always forget to get myself a knife. <laughs> but yeah, I should be able to uh, hopefully get rid of this plastic. Easy, there you go. We got this. We absolutely got this loot. All right, so the plastic is all off coming off nicely. Ugh, there you go. Gold Sim Litter 3 and it's an amazing glory. Let's kind of open up the box right here. And uh, one second fellas, I gotta just make sure that I uh, got the box all open. So over here you guys can see this includes the pre-order gear, which is really awesome. Code expires in uh, 2032, so you know, quite some miles away. We also grab ourselves the digital downgrade edition as well. So in case you guys wanted to grab yourselves the PlayStation 4 version, this would also work too, which I reckon is pretty dope. Also, of course, the internals of the, of the box over here. You can see looking really awesome. Let me kind of make this straight. Beautiful. I kind of do wish there was a bit of uh, paperwork on that. Let's kind of check out and make sure this over here is nice and clean. And yeah, we can definitely expect the, the cleanliness and the blue game is loot, as you guys can see in the background. Really dope. I'm gonna put those babies all the way to the side over there. Let's, let's kind of check out the downgrade version over here. You guys can see it's in all different languages. So we had digital downgrade version, digital downgrade, and basically in different languages, as you guys can see. So yeah, I'm expecting the same for the other one over here, the pre order gear. As y'all can see, same stuff. So I think I'll kind of uh, just place that all the way down. So yeah, really awesome loot there. So what else do we grab inside here? We grab ourselves a really cool looking plushie and oh my goodness, man, look at this. This is so cute. This is so damn cute, man. Look at that. It's got some Velcro there, it's tongue all sticking now. So of course the Velcro is right here. You can always just sort of pop it on just like that. This is so cute. <laughs> Let me put that lovely goat, <clears throat> goat all the way to the side over there. Next over here, of course, we got ourselves a steel case. And I cannot believe 
This goat in a box edition includes a steel case. And oh my goodness gracious me, man. You guys know me. I am all about loot. And when you get yourself a steel case, I get very excited because some developers and artists forget about the steel case. And over here, you can see coffee stain north at the bottom. Let me kind of get this thing to focus. Coffee stain north. You can see the kind of um, silhouette of the really nice goat. The goat on top there. Side profile over here. Goat Simulator 3 in its amazing glory. I'm really feeling the steel case, guys. The simplicity is pretty dope, man. Wow. Look at that. Let's kind of open up the steel case. And over here, you guys can see the physical soundtrack. And oh, man, this is hot. Woo! Man, this is some really awesome loot here, man. A really cool physical soundtrack. It's in, in its amazing flesh. And even the background is looking so nice, too. Yeah, this is what I call really awesome loot. I think I'll probably just leave the disc in there, but... Soundtrack included, fellas, not for resale, as they like to say. But you really gotta love this loot, man. Wow. I'm feeling this imagery over here. This is dope, man. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think of the Goat Simulator steel case. That is hot. Let me put that bad boy all the way to the back there. Next to the plushie. Next over here, we grab ourselves some loot still. So let's kind of get these out. First thing that I want to kind of show you guys is the lovely map. Let's kind of check out this map. So San, ooh, look at that map, man. I'll kind of show you guys from bottom all the way to the top. And of course the legend over here, Goat Tower, Instinct Shrine, or Table. A really nice big map of the entirety of the game. This is really awesome. I kind of do wish this map was made out of a, uh, say like a really awesome material, that would have been dope. But nevertheless, guys, you're getting all this. And over here, you guys can see a really dope image. What I'll do right now, actually, let me put this onto the carpet so, so, so y'all can see the entire image. I kind of just move this down. But check this out, man. This is hot. So the musical motion picture. You know me, the loot loves all kinds of awesome artistry and this is no exception. Man, this is awesome. For 100 Australian dollars, man. You guys will definitely hear my final thoughts at the end of the video. But yeah, that over there, fellas, is the map in the flesh. Really awesome piece of loot. Alrighty, now let's kind of fold this bad boy together. But yeah, I'm really feeling this map, fellas. Really, really awesome. Next over here, guys, is some really awesome postcards. And as you guys know, the loot game is all about the awesome postcards. Because we want to check out how awesome the artistry is. And, and am, am I able to get this out really nice and gently? We don't want to ruin our loot. You got to have that respect. Because we may want to put this back in. Alright. There you go. Easy. So over here, you guys can see the really awesome postcards. You gotta love the back imagery. Let's just show the back of everything. De La Cream and San Angora. Over here, you can see bug one all the way up until bug five. Let's kind of turn these babies around. Over here, you guys can see Flyman. So Flyman buzzing bad guys in cinemas. <laughs> really awesome. Next over here, De La Cream, San Angora. The really awesome goat over there. Next one over here, we got greetings from San Angora. Really nice. Honestly, fellas, this is a really awesome collector edition. But yeah, let me know what you guys think of these really nice looking postcards. Oh man, Goat Simulator 3, Goat in a Box Edition. What are my final thoughts of this legendary piece of loot? Honestly, for the price point of 100 Australian dollars, you guys, great, you guys grab yourselves a really cute looking plushie, steelbook, really cool looking packaging box, postcards, really cool map, and really cool artistry from the other side. The game, of course, a downgrade version of the game for PlayStation 4, pre-order gear, and overall, fellas, the value of this and a physical soundtrack. Yeah, this over here is definitely the seal of approval from the loot gamer to go ahead and pick this up. Definitely worth a hundred Australian dollars. If you guys enjoy these types of videos, give us a like and subscribe. We are the Loot Gamer.
Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you later. Deuces.